NBA Friday night, and it was the return of Carl Anthony Towns from Minnesota. His first action since December 13th due to a knee injury. Picked this up in the second half, and Towns looking good from outside. 6'11", big man, obviously been working on that shot. Kick out here from Andrew Wiggins. Towns again from the same spot outside the arc. Then working inside, Carl Anthony Towns. 27 points, 5 rebounds in the game. Minnesota at this point, up by one, third quarter. To the fourth we go, T.J. Warren. What a season he's having for the Pacers. 28 points, five rebounds. Pacers up by eight at this point. t Wolves trying to come back. Wiggins inside. 22-point night for him. It's a tie game. Under a minute to go. Malcolm Brogdon, 12 points, 10 assists. Puts the Pacers up by a deuce. Wiggins out to Shabazz Napier for three. And the lead. No. Jump ball called on the rebound. So on the ensuing jump ball, Indiana wins the tip. Jeremy Lamb is fouled. So sit down, talk about it, a little strategy. Watch this inbounds play. 1.1 seconds left. Justin Holiday throws it off the back of Robert Covington, and time runs out. 116-114, Indiana gets the win. Minnesota hasn't won a game with Towns in the lineup since before Thanksgiving. That's eight straight losses. Friday night in the NBA, let's go to Philadelphia and a matchup of hopeful Eastern Conference All-Stars. Ben Simmons of the Sixers and Chicago's Zach Levine, the former slam dunk champion, putting on a show in the first half. Watch this. Alley oop with the high hops for Levine. And then the double clutch dunk. Watch this in the fast break. Levine, part of a 23-point night, just below his season average. One more look at it. Levine would love to be an All-Star at his home court in Chicago next month. Shaq to the full nominee here. Sixers move the ball around and cork mods. Three bulls are red hot. Why? Well, upon further review, the Sixers had six players on the floor. Uh, we checked the rule book. That's one too many. Not allowed. So the three-pointer taken off the board. The Sixers charged with a technical. And they just may make Shaq to the full. Uh, certainly deservedly so. On the inbounds here, Bulls turn the ball over. Simmons, big time stuff right there. Still on the Stat sheets on the night. 20 points, 11 rebounds, 7 assists. Still the Sixers down by 1 at the break, but they create some space in the second half. Al Horford, 3 of his 20 points. Simmons inside the putback dunk. Then Korkmaz for 3. This time with only 4 teammates on the court. 14 points to the quarter for Korkmaz. He had a huge night. 6 three-pointers, career high 24 points, 189. Sixers win without Joel Embiid yet again. They're now 20 and 2 at home on the season. A couple of superstars, Luka Doncic of the Mavericks hosting Portland's Damian Lillard. Mono e mono in the first quarter. Lillard up first, 11 points in the quarter for him. Pull up three over Luka. Three of four shooting from outside the arc, but uh, Luca says what you can do, I can do better. He went four of five from three-point range in the first quarter. 14 points for him early on. Big night also for Carmelo Anthony. Gets fouled inside, and at the line, it's the veteran Carmelo becoming the 18th player in NBA history to score 26,000 points, hitting the milestone there on the first free throw for the veteran scorer. Well done, Carmelo Anthony. Bad news for Portland, though. C.J. McCollum on the drive here, missing the layup, but he did hit the foot of his defender, twisting that ankle there. Ugh. C.J. McCollum leaving the game, only 12 minutes of action. He did not return. We wish the best for him. Back to Luka now. Six of eight from three in the first half. 23 points at halftime. Dallas scoring 72 in the first half. Nine-point lead as we go to the second half now. Dorian Finney-Smith misses. Justin Jackson the rebound to Tim Hardaway Jr. for the three. Hardaway with 29 points for Dallas. But back to Doncic, career high. Eight trays in the game. That's just one less than what Portland had as a team on this night. Blazers all sticking around. Lillard, the drive, makes the contact, gets the hoop. And the free throw, Lillard, 34 points, 10 assists. Hassan Whiteside inside with the big night. 21 points, 18 rebounds for the Portland big man, but too much from Luka. Drives inside for the layup, that's two, and then three more. How about a 35-point night for him? Eight rebounds, seven assists, 120 to 112. Luka just missing, getting his NBA best 13th triple-double. The Mavs win despite missing Christoph Porzingis for the 10th game in a row due to injuries.